Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the power eleven in chapter nineteen. Chapter nineteen is about heat. First law of thermodynamics. So we can see we have a coffee pot, right? And this coffee pot is a power is given. It is a P, and then it made of aluminum. And the aluminum, the specific uh, heat for aluminum, you can check is given at there. Now this uh, coffee pot can just uh, include the water, so the volume of water is given inside of this uh, pot is water, so the water volume is given 0 0.75 liter, and very easily you can remember the density of water, right? Right it is there, and also the specific heat for water is given, so we write it is there, and it tells us the coffee pot boils the water initially is a uh, 8 30 degree and then it just uh, boils at the final so final temperature is 100 30 degree agree yes so we can see the temperature changes is use the final temperature 100 minus initial temperature 8 and then we get is 92 30 degree now we need to find the time taking for this uh, process we can see the energy is conserved because it tell you ignore the heat loss so that means the energy consumed by the coffee pot equals to the energy gained by the water, right? So we can see the first energy is heat. So this one, the heat absorbed by the water equal to power times T. Now this heat is by the water part and by the aluminum part, agree? So this two part. So for water part, C M dot T. So C is aluminum, C is water mass water and dirty and for the aluminum part is also C aluminum mass aluminum and dirty so you can see inside we don't know the mass of water but we know it's a V and a rho right so we use density times the volumes we get the mass of the water now we input it inside there's a function for T T is Q over P very easy right T equal to Q over P and input the Q inside we input all the known quantities get answer there. Thank you.